Norwegian meatball left the wrap. Dehydrated Idaho russets. Rehydrate with water. Extra virgin olive oil. OK. Kosher salt. We need our mashed potatoes and our flour. Now we're going to ball it up. We're going to okay. roll them out. So for every lefse you make, you have to go through this whole process. Correct. So if you tried to pick this up, it would just break off. It would tear. And you have your Harry Potter sword, and Correct. you're going to be able to pick that up. <laughs> this place is magical. This is the lefse wand. And then you come over to the griddle, and you roll it out. It's going to cook usually about 35 seconds each but side. But once it gets cooked, it will hold together enough that you can use it as a wrap. OK, our next game plan is we're going to make our ye toast gravy. Ye so, toast. Ye toast. This is a roux, so I kind of brown the butter and I brown the flour a little bit. Milk, white wine. Great. Madeira wine, kosher salt, our ye toast cheese, nutmeg. Next, meatballs. Start with our fried breadcrumbs, milk and cream, eggs. The toasted flour that we end up with right. from making lefsa, we save it and use it. Well done. Caramelized onions, salt, black pepper, allspice, ground, ground beef and ground pork. Chill this for three hours. And then we're going to bake them off? For eight minutes. About 4, 4.75. We've toasted our lefsa, green cabbage. And then this is the sour call, which is a sweet and sour purple cabbage with caraway seed. Caraway with it. This is the ye toast gravy that you saw. Yes. Meatballs. Roll it up, kind of like a burrito. Cut it in half. <laughs> How have I existed this long <laughs> without having this? Delicious, tender, nice meatball. Ye toast sauce. Mm -hmm. Lights out. Wow, that's good. Yeah. Thank you.